Testing, testing, testing. I'm standing on the corner at Ensenal on High Street in Alameda's East End, about to show you the best kept secret that you need to know about if you're gonna to move to Alameda's East End. And we're gonna start right now. What's going on guys, it's Hans Strazina with another video. Today we're talking about the East End's best kept secret. As you know, I moved to a different part of the island and this is one of the biggest things that I miss from living down here on the East End. I'm about to show it to you. We're here on the corner of Ensenal and High Street and uh, really excited about this because if you're thinking about moving to Alameda's East End, this is one of these things that you need to factor in and it's right behind me. It's the Ensenal Market. Although the market is awesome, it's more to it than just the market itself. Uh, the Bluefin Sushi and Thai restaurant, Feel Good Bakery um, that's in the complex, as well as the mailbox, drop box, it's all a combination and it's one of the best things about living here on Alameda's East End. All right, so here's the thing. I used to live about a block from here to walk down here, ride my bike down here for really quick trips to the grocery store. It was honestly one of the best conveniences I could have ever asked for. Now that I don't have it, I seriously miss it. Uh, being able to, to go down to Ensenal for one or two quick grocery items was awesome. It was uh, convenient it was easy you didn't have to shop nearly as much um, for those big trips at least and especially with COVID you could just pop down grab a couple of things you didn't have to stand in line with at the store uh, not to mention there's a mail drop box right up at the corner there is a fantastic beverage selection for wine liquor spirits uh, beer all that stuff and then across the parking lot they have feel good bakery and right on the corner is bluefin uh, sushi and thai which is a fantastic restaurant if you're into that kind of food i would highly recommend for takeout um, there's also a couple of other shops in the complex uh, for nails and a coffee so stop and all that sort of thing but really the main attraction is Ensenal. Um, i have to tell you if you're thinking about moving here, uh, it may not show up in the listing literature. It may end up um, being sort of passed off as like, oh, that's a cool benefit or something. But I promise you, you will use this. You will come here regularly. And so if you're considering a, a place that, let's say, is within a half a mile of this intersection right here on the map, uh, you will come to Ensenal very, very regularly. I can promise you that. Um, and uh, if you're weighing between a house that's somewhere else and something that's close by to Ensenal, I would say put this in the wind column as well because it's a huge luxury to be able to have. Um, it's, uh, gosh, I can't tell you how many times I've come here and just uh, pop down the street for one or two things or the last minute thing right as you're halfway through cooking dinner. Uh, it's a lifesaver. So hopefully you got some value out of that. Seriously, consider it. If you're going to move to the East End, think about your proximity to this grocery store. It is fantastic uh, to be able just to walk over there, to bike over there, grab some meat, some beverages, uh, some produce, which they have a great selection by the way, um, and, and be able to do it kind of last minute. So you're not always thinking about Trader Joe's, Knob Hill, one of the others, um, where sometimes there's a line, sometimes the, you know they're out of things. Um, this place is almost always stocked and it's ready to go for you. Um, so think about your proximity to Ensenal Market if you're going to move here to the East End and definitely put that in the wind column if there's something that you're looking at a house that is uh, within a half a mile because that's very walkable or bikeable because um, I know that from experience. So hopefully you got some value out of this and if you did give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel because I'm going to continue to put out weekly content just like this and you're not going to want to miss it. So without any further ado, this is Hans Strazina with the Gunnerman Group at Keller Williams Luxury International signing off for now. See you guys on the next one.